Hi guys, happy Saturday. I hope you're all having a fantastic day today and a really beautiful weekend. So yesterday I ended up going to bed at like 10, 15 at night, which was kind of depressing considering it was a Friday. Um, but I didn't have anything going on and I was really tired because I guess it was the day before I'd gotten up early and walked a lot, but my foot hurt. I was tired. Whatever. I was tired. That's the point of the whole story. Um, this isn't even supposed to be about, it's supposed to be about nail polish, but whatever. It's my daily vlog, so I can mix the two together if I want to, and it's just going to be that way. So there. Um, earlier today I went to the Strawberry Festival. It is in Oxnard or Ventura, somewhere in Ventura County, I think Oxnard. It was really nice. I went with Froggy and a few friends, and Lauren and her husband were there. I didn't film anything because I suck and my foot hurt and my hands were full, but I got a vanilla amber body butter and it's like 100% shea butter with essential oils and fragrances, so I will give you guys an opinion on it when I try it more than just a quick sample and I'll show it to you when I can reach it, but right now I can't. I've already talked for a little bit and I wanted to show you guys some new nail polishes that I got a little while ago. Um, Colors by LaRoe did a restock on... Well, LaRoe is a website that sells all sorts of nail polishes by Indie Makers International and um, made in the country, LaRoe.com, L-L-A-W-R-O-E. I would link it below, but I've linked it before. Anyway, um, Leanne did a restock of her personal line, which is called Colors by LaRoe. And so I got one from this spring collection and one from, I'm not sure when, but it was discontinued. So this was my last chance to get it. And I have them right here, and then I have the two Colors by LaRoe that I already owned for comparison because they're kind of similar. I am wearing Colors by LaRoe rocking my Juju right now, which on my fingers looks kind of just duochrome but this is one of the old ones, this isn't a new one. In the bottle you can see all the holographic stuff. So this is one I've already shown you guys, but that's all my nails rocking my Juju. Outside in the sun it looks crazy holographic, and so it does it in the bottle, but not so much on the nails. Okay. So, as far as the two that I just purchased, this one is Paper Moon, and it is a lavender or lilac linear hollow. This is the one that was discontinued, and it's really, really pretty. The holographic effect looks a little stronger than Rockin' My Juju. So here they are side by side. Um, this one in front of my face, this is Rockin' My Juju, and the other one is Paper Moon. So they're kind of similar, I guess, but... I don't know, they look much more different in real life than they do on camera. If I could just line them up, see? You can see the blue and the purple more, I guess. I don't know, the lighting in here sucks, and I'm using my, my phone instead of my flip cam, so whatever. But that's the new one, Paper Moon. And then the other new one is called Young Turks, and it is so pretty. This is like such a blue turquoise teal holographic, and... Again, it looks just like the other one that I already have from Colors by LaRoe, which is called Good Fortune. I'm trying to get them to like line up correctly so when I hold them up they're actually like side by side. Okay, so Good Fortune is the one in front of my face and um, Young Turks is the one on the left. And they look really, really similar, but the Young Turks, the one on this side, has a little more blue and this one has a little more rainbow. But yeah, they are kind of similar. I'm going to have to swatch them side by side. Um, but I swear there's got to be a more effective way to compare them there. Okay, so uh, Good Fortune's on the top, Young Turks is on the bottom. Different but the same-ish. Anyway, so there's four minutes of explanation on why I have four nail polishes that are so similar. Because I just couldn't decide between any of them, so apparently I needed all of them. I don't know, I had one night of like, I went shopping online, and that was that. So now I'm going to put them up on the shelf in that spot right there, and I'm going to upload this for you guys. Um, I hope you stuck through it to the end, I hope you enjoyed it. Combo vlog nail polish haul, uh, I did not film the strawberry festival, and I didn't film Avery eating strawberries, it was cute, but it happened. Anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you like this video and um, thumbs up for nail polish if you do, especially holographics. And comment below and tell me what's your favorite brand of holographic polish or what you guys did this weekend or if you guys like any like local festival-y things that happen around you or what the coolest ones are. I want to know stuff. And I've been talking for five minutes, so it's time for me to go. But you guys are awesome. Thank you for being there. Thank you for watching me. And I will see you tomorrow.